Hello everybody doing a video here. Sorry to have to do it in my car, but it's just crazy busy in my house right now. So there's nowhere to do it at the moment, but we're gonna be talking about the Patrice Bergeron signing. Now Bergeron is a player that had been playing very well. He is going into his 19th season in the NHL. Of course, has played 18 seasons before this, all with the Boston Bruins dating back to the 2003-04 season before they had the walkout. Has played over 1,200 NHL games in the regular season and, of course, is now the team captain for them. He is 37 years old, will be entering, of course, into his 19th season now with the Spoked Bees and has done an amazing job in that time, a five-time Selkie Trophy winner and has been very, very good coming off a 25-goal, 65-point season in 73 regular season games, and it won his fifth Selkie. Now, of course, that award is a little bit biased. Uh, I think that that does play a factor in it, but we have seen just how good of a two-way player Bergeron has been in his career, and I think we will continue to see him play well. He is signing a one-year deal, $2.5 million for the season. However, it has contract incentives incentives that make it at least two and a half million dollars additional in money so he could be making up to five million dollars this season i have to say i think this is an absolute steal and could be a very very good deal for the bruins and if he does make five million no big deal because that means he's probably hitting those incentives and means that he does deserve to be paid that amount of money I am curious, though, to see how he comes back from the injury. He is 37. He has logged a lot of time in the NHL. How will he do in the, you know, this upcoming season, and will they reduce his minutes? That's going to be a big question here as well. He has averaged over 18 minutes for quite some time now at a night, but has seen a reduction in minutes. I think we could see him maybe play about 18 minutes per night. But you absolutely know that he will be out there with the perfection line, trying to do whatever they can to help their team out, scoring a bunch of goals, limiting a bunch of chances, and just overall just dominating competition. We're going to have to see how it goes, but for the Bruins, it is good for them knowing that they will get their captain back, and he will be there to help them out down the middle especially and really help out their playoff chances. Is it always the healthiest idea to rely on a 37-year-old to play top line minutes for you and to have to be one of your best players? No, but Bergeron has, of course, been so good for so long, aging like a fine wine, and continues to produce for the Bruins that it would be silly not to imagine them you know, relying on him and then using him again. Will they do so next year? Tough to say, but of course, he will be in Boston yet again, hopefully able to run for another cup run we'll have to see but now of course i'll be able to do my season previews have been having to hold off boston's going to be putting theirs out next week but i'm curious to see what you guys think do you think this is a good extension for the bruins let me know down below in the comments below also please make sure to like this video and subscribe if you're new now we'll get to see maybe if caudry when and where he will sign but anyway everybody please make sure to like and subscribe stay safe have a great night and eagle love hockey all right Goodbye, Brigadiers and Brigadettes. This is your captain signing off. Have a great night.